everybody, how's it going? It's Bronson from Fretz RV here in Satterton, Pennsylvania. Looking at another Winnebago product here today. We have the 1808 FBS. Only 20 feet long. Just over 3,700 pounds dry weight. This is going to be one of those perfect campers for if there's maybe just one or two of you. Bring the, bring the pet along. You're going to have plenty of space in there. You do have a slide out on here. Again, 20 foot trailer. It's going to make it seem like it's got a lot of space. A lot of storage on this as well. They got that great Winnebago name known for their quality. Start up front, two 20 pound tanks come on here, electric tongue jack as well. You've got your fiberglass front cap, fiberglass all outside as well. Winnebago is known for that. Nice wide storage under here. But you can pop this up, it does have magnets. So I want you to take note of these thick doors. A lot of other guys, you're seeing these will be a lot thinner. Nice big pass through storage underneath here as well. We have the 100 watt solar panel on the roof of this, so you've got your controller that stores under there as well. Another nice feature, slam latch. You do have a propane port underneath as well if you want to bring a little outdoor grill with you. You can do so. Still going to have a power awning, LED strip under there as well. You can have some outdoor speakers. That's going to be your fridge ventilation. Your water tank fill is going to be over here. Look at these. Awesome looking wheels and tires, 15 inch tires, aluminum wheels on these as well. Comes a part of their off-road package, it sits up a little higher. Got the nice metal under there as well. Let's take a walk back here. Got your steps that fold out. Window on your door. Asdale on board. That's what the sticker says here, for those of you that know about it. You do get a ladder standard, it's prepped for a backup camera. Got a spare tire on the back. Come around the other side, you'll find all your connections for your 30 amp cable. You got an outdoor shower, all your water hookups, and you have a black tank flush on board as well. Keep that black tank cleaned out. Here's that slide out. It's a pretty deep one, so it makes a lot of a lot of difference on the inside uh, space wise in terms of moving around. Definitely gives you some more floor space. And coming around this other side, you'll find your water heater, your uh, other side of your pass through storage. Pop up on the inside and get a look at this thing as well. Come around here. Step it up into the inside. This said tons of storage in this thing. 20 foot trailer. It looks like they fit storage everywhere they possibly could. Right away when you walk in, you got your entertainment, your TVs right here, your uh, stereo control. It's got USB auxiliary Bluetooth that you can hook up onto here. Uh, this one also has. The 12 volt tank heaters on board, so it's a heated and closed underbelly. Forced air blows down into there, and you've also got pads that are on the tanks as well for heating. Slide out controls, all your tank levels, thermostats over here. Four separate doors here for storage. Top and bottom open up, and both on this side as well. Coming in, let's get a good pan around here. Got your big dinette. A lot of times a trailer of this size, you'll find they're only about half the size of that, so you can easily fit two on two on either side, and that'll make it to a sleeping space. That tabletop will drop down flat, make a sleeper here for you as well. Got your full bed there in the back, AC mounted up top, kitchen space, still have a nice big open sink here as well, stainless steel. Plenty of space to be able to fit multiple things in here. Get your hands in there deep, and then you've got your faucet as well. Plenty of storage down below here. Nice space maybe for a little waste basket. Gonna have your pull-out drawers here as well. Nice and long, all the way down. And instead of giving you an oven on this, huge storage space down here below as well. Your three-burner cooktop, if this folds up. So you've got your three burners. Glass to protect it, make some more counter space, then two huge drawers right down beneath here as well. Actually, this one will be your breaker box and fuse panel. Convection microwave, so since you don't have the oven, you can still put some things in there. Use it for convection, storage up above here as well. Eight cubic foot gas electric refrigerator. This thing is huge for a trailer of this size. Open it up to find your freezer above. Fridge down below, shelving on either side. You even got storage that'll, that'll go to your pass-through underneath. You even got some bins up above as well. 
I'll open one up here so you can see how far back that goes. It goes down to either end. USB up above your bed space or plugging in any of your devices. A little storage cubby there as well. You've got outlets down below here as well if you need to plug in anything for that space. Storage underneath your dinette as well. Both of those will open up. Got your pull down shades. The bed also has a privacy curtain here for you. Let's go in the bathroom. A little tighter space in here, but hey, it's 20 feet and you still get sink, shower, toilet all in one space. Still plenty enough space here for when you're sitting down, your legs are going to have room there, you're not going to feel so crammed. Medicine cabinet will open up. You'll have some down there as well. You got outlets, a plug. Like I said stainless steel, nice to see. They changed the colors for the interior of these in 2021. They look a lot more modern. Modern colors, modern looks. Nice bright area in here. Like I said, big floor space in here for a 20 foot trailer. 13.5K BTU, air conditioner still on board. This is the Winnebago 1808 FBS here. Fritz RV in Southampton, Pennsylvania. Again, my name is Bronson. If you have any more questions on this product or any other Winnebago product, please feel free to give me a call. Let me know. I'll be glad to help. Like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe for plenty more content I'll have coming out. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.